This is for air sign. Daily reading for air sign. <clears throat> air sign. be walking away from something. Um, five of Cups. I have Five of Cups here. Stalemate. Two of Swords. You're stuck. Why is Two of Swords here? The Magician. You're trying to manifest being unstuck. Um, why is the Magician here? Page of Cups could be with a water sign um, or you could have new love. So you're manifesting how to get to that. Why is Page of Cups here? You could be married to this person. Um, Queen of Cups. She loves you. Here. Why is Queen of Cups here? She loves you. Oh, King of Cups. Okay. Queen of Cups, King of Cups. Wow. I feel like you love her too, but why are you walking away then? That's very odd. Um... Queen of Cups, King of Cups. Why is King of Cups here? Okay, so I'm seeing something here. Um, I know the King of Cups represents love, <clears throat> but what I'm seeing is that notice how her cup is full and bright and has a light and his doesn't. I feel like the way he loves and she loves is different. She loves with a light, with a brightness. He loves her in his own way, but it's darkness. He, he is a darkness. Um, or he could have once loved this person and now he doesn't. Um, why is King of Cups? Here, I'm going to take these. The full three of swords. Yeah, see, there's a third party. Um, or there's been multiple third parties. The full, he wants to walk away from this. I don't feel like um, he has love here anymore, like I saw. I just, I don't, with the Three of Swords and then the Fool, it's like, for some of you, for some of you, this person or you could be wanting to walk away from the heartache, right, and start new, slowly. And for others of you, I feel like this person wants to just walk away completely and start something completely new. Um, why is the Fool and the Three of Swords here? Nine of Wands. I feel like this person has tried. He feels like, he or she feels like they tried, 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 tried to make things work and they just can't. Why is Nine of Wands here? Why? Um, he's looking at this situation and it's just not fulfilling. He or she. 
there's another person. See how the Three of Cups are empty and then there's the one in the back? He's tired. They This person is tired of the Three of Cups, the third party, and they want the third party, basically. Okay, that's what I'm seeing here, for sure. Um, why is Four of Cups here? Yeah, um, the world, this is a karmic cycle that's ending, okay? Um, I don't want to say it's ended because it's not. The energy is still very much there, but it's ending. It's trying to end, right? This karmic cycle is trying to end, um, and then Three of Cups. And then something new is trying to come in in its place. But this karmic cycle, this karmic cycle is like, you know, I don't know who this is, but I feel like this person, y'all have been in this for a long time. You could have met this person when you were 30, when they were 32 or you were 32. Um, or you could be 32 now. Um... Yeah, this karmic cycle is trying to end and you're just not letting it go. Um, wow. <sighs> what are the blocks here? Balance. There's not enough emotional balance. There's not enough emotions from both sides. That's a block. Well, of course it is. If one person loves someone, somebody more than the other, that's hello. Guidance here. Guidance here. The guidance is to, you need to think about what you want. Um, this card I know represents um, like fantasizing and stuff like that. But when people think about what they want, what do they do? They fantasize about it, right? Um, when you fantasize about something, you're also manifesting. I don't know um, if people know that or not, but... When you fantasize and you lay in bed and you think about what you really want and that's a manifestation. You're manifesting that thought. Guidance is to um, be truthful and you might want to come quick with the truth. Come quick with the truth. I feel like this is speaking to the other person, the person that you do really love. You need to be, you need to come quick with it. Um, justice, divorce, and then taking a break. So justice, this situation needs to be balanced out. A lot of you, this is a divorce, um, four swords, and then you're going to need to take a break from this. Some of you could already be in the middle of a divorce. Or some of you could have already spoken and said you wanted a divorce. What is the advice here for air sign here daily for this situation? Let your friends help you stay optimistic about your love life. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. This is speaking to the third party. The third party is your soulmate. Yes. Finances and career are affecting your love life. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a high level of commitment. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. I feel like that's telling you keep an open mind because your soulmate is not your, your spouse. So... Your feelings are real and worth exploring. One more card for air sign here. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. And I saw that. It's time to take a break. Um, passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. So if you have any other questions, my information is in the description box. Uh, and I will see you in the morning.